Hey there, viewers. Acne can make you self-conscious. Just as these bad boys pop up on your face, they can pop up on your back, too. Those ugly pimples on your back are known as bacne, and it's more common than you think. In today's video, let's discuss how to get rid of bacne once and for all. Do you need to use any special products? What type of clothes should you be wearing? Let's talk about all that and more. Number 1. Don't squeeze back lesions Keep your hands off those pimples! However tempted you might feel to get rid of the gunk inside, avoid it at all costs. Whenever you feel the urge to pop one, try and distract yourself. There's a good chance your hand germs will transfer to those zits and then multiply rapidly. That can worsen the situation and cause flare-ups. Picking those lesions can also cause slower healing. Repeated attempts to break open those pores can leave permanent dark spots and scars. Number 2. Stop consuming whey protein Almost all gym rats have protein shakes as a pre-workout snack. Whey is a byproduct formed while making cottage cheese. This food can stimulate the production of a hormone called IGF-1 or insulin-like growth factor 1. This is a great hormone and helps your body to grow, especially when you want muscles. But it also stimulates oil-producing glands that secrete more sebum. More oil usually means more acne. Number 3. Swap your body wash, shampoo, and hair conditioner. Before we talk about why you should be looking for new bathroom products, let's learn how acne forms. Every inch of your skin is porous. It excretes sweat, dead cells, pollutants, and dirt. There are oil-secreting glands near the pores that keep producing oil to keep your skin soft and supple. Sometimes when pores clog, all the notorious things that should have been washed away get trapped. This is the perfect environment for bacteria to grow and cause flare-ups. Doctors can prescribe a body wash that has 5-10% to of benzoyl peroxide. This powerful cleanser can wipe out all those bacteria on the back. But it might stain and ruin your clothing later on, so be sure you've fully rinsed. You can also try shampoos that are packed with zinc. Pityrosperum folliculitis is another name for bacne. Uncontrolled growth of yeast on your skin can cause it. Also, small flakes of dandruff falling from your scalp onto the back can clog pores and cause acne. Antifungal shampoos and body wash help. Look out for products that have salicylic acid or glycolic acid as an active ingredient. These can dry up the pimples and shrink it in size. Avoid using leave-in conditioner. Make sure you have rinsed off all the conditioner before you step out of the shower, or else it can trickle down onto your back and make it extra oily. Number 4. Change your hair care habits a relaxing head massage with oil can be so beneficial, but keeping oil in overnight is bound to give you back acne. Night oiling should be avoided at all costs, but if you have to, take a quick bath before you sleep. If you have long hair, try wearing your hair up as much as possible or just go for short hair and change your look. Number 5. Changing Your Hair Removal Method there are so many ways to get rid of the fuzz on your back. Waxing, shaving, and epilating all work perfectly. But if you have been noticing small bumps after your salon session, you can try changing your hair removal method. Reverse shaving or failing to exfoliate the dead skin can block pores. So make an extra effort to pamper your skin and get rid of those bumps. Number 6. Use Oil-Free Moisturizers Dry skin needs frequent oiling, but too much oil won't make your acne-prone skin very happy. Choose gel-based and water-based moisturizers to combat that dryness, especially during winter. Doctors can also prescribe products or moisturizers that will allow your pores to breathe. Don't leave bacne ointments and creams on your back for a long time. Generally, these creams come in an oil base and must be washed off. Also, when you go for massage therapy, try getting rid of the aromatic oils as quickly as possible. Before we move ahead, watch spirulina, the superfood for your skin to keep your skin healthy and glowing. Number 7. Avoid too much pressure on your back Heavy backpacks, sports gear, and back braces are notorious to lock in sweat and cause acne due to occlusion. Try opting for smaller backpacks that are lightweight, fit properly, and minimize irritation. If you have to wear shoulder pads, try wearing a loose cotton shirt under it. This reduces friction and reddening. Number 8. Change your eating habits Having a bag of chips or too many sweets may give you a quick pick-me-up, but the after-effects are not very pleasant. A diet that is high in sugar and carbohydrates should be avoided. Fatty and fried foods are also off-limits for an acne-prone person. To cleanse your skin from within, you need to add more natural foods to your diet like green leafy vegetables, fish, tomato, broccoli, berries, and more. These are known anti-inflammatory foods that will calm down these irritated pimples. Having omega-3 rich foods can also do the trick. Having a handful of walnuts, spreading some avocado on your toast, or some salmon fillets for your meals can give you the ultimate boost of omega-3. These foods have shown promising results in the reduction of acne. 
Number 9. Exfoliate This requires you to gently remove the top layer of skin that might have dead skin, microorganisms, and excess oil. Mechanical exfoliation can be done with the help of a long-handled cleaning brush. Just squeeze some acne-fighting body wash on the loofah and scrub your back. You can also use different flavored scrubs from coffee to apricot to lotus and honey. But you have to be extra gentle while you do this unless you want to have a fiery red back. Chemical exfoliation is another way to go about it. If you don't want to do the hard work, just leave 10% benzoyl peroxide cleanser for 5 to 10 minutes on your back. Keeping it on like a mask can make it work better. These two procedures may take a few days to subside the flare-ups and stop new acne from forming. But if you're in a real hurry, you can try chemical peels. Over-the-counter peel pads have strong medical ingredients that can do the trick quickly. However, frequent use of such harsh chemicals is not advised. Number 10. Drink lots of water. Water is literally the solution for most problems in your body. All your systems function exactly the way they should when your body is hydrated. But if your body is running low on water, it can reduce skin turnover rate and make it look more grainy and dull. Adding a couple more glasses of water to your day wouldn't hurt. Number 11. Wear washed clothes Changing into new clothes when you come home from work is not enough. You need to change those jammies every day too. Wearing freshly laundered clothes can not only make you feel clean but also help with your condition. Unwashed clothes can lock in sweat, oil, dirt, and germs. Also, remember to change your pillowcase and bed sheets frequently. Tight clothes like yoga pants, shorts, or synthetic clothes should not be worn for long periods of time. Try picking fabrics that can stay super dry even if you sweat a lot. Cotton and linen clothes are the most breathable, but they hold on to the most moisture, creating a hospitable environment for bacteria to grow. So avoiding them while working out is best. Number 12. Shower after your workout there is so much sweating in the shoulder, back, and neck region when you work out. If you let the humidity stay around, it's only going to make things worse. If you can't shower immediately, at least wipe yourself off with a dry towel or a non comedogenic set of wipes. Having lactic acid as an active ingredient of these wipes can help reduce that acne dramatically. Number 13. Avoid some medicines Hormonal pills and a few steroids can cause breakouts even if you're doing everything else correctly. A few other medicines with lithium can also be potentially dangerous. If you notice changes in your skin after a new set of medicines have started, you can always talk to your doctor for alternatives. Number 14. Avoid excessive sun exposure all those beach vacations and tanning beds will have to wait. Getting exposed to excessive sunlight can worsen the situation. The harmful UV rays can darken that acne and leave nasty scars. Remember to use sunscreen that has SPF 30 or more before stepping out. Your sunscreen should be oil-free too. One application will last for about 3-4 to four hours, so reapply for protection from the sun. Acne affects almost everyone at least once, if not many times in their lives. Knowing what to do when these pesky bumps show up is very important. Let's keep the conversation going with a couple more acne-related videos, shall we? Watch 7 Easy Ways to Clear Up Acne or 14 Health Symptoms That Men Should Never Ignore. Go ahead, click one, or better yet watch both and learn more about how to get clear skin. Do you know any other ways to get rid of back acne? Let us know in the comments below.